Well, it's been 40 years since Terry Fox was forced to end his marathon of hope outside Thunder Bay. Ever since, Canadians gather every year to raise money for cancer research. Hold on. You're probably wondering, who the heck is this guy and why is he on the news? Let me explain. I'm Will. I started Sprout to build a platform that inspires people to push themselves outside of their comfort zones and realize how great they really are. I've been challenging you guys to join me on adventures and help inspire others. And this time, the challenge was to get as many Sprout fan members from around the world to get out and go for a run. Run anywhere between 5k and a full marathon, wherever you are in the world, and prove to yourself that you can achieve so much more than you think. So it takes a lot, and I mean, you know, everyone's been affected by cancer, everyone knows someone who's been affected by cancer, so we're running for them too. We're also running for this guy, Terry Fox. When he was just 18 years old, Terry Fox was diagnosed with bone cancer and forced to have his right knee amputated. While he was in the hospital, he saw so many other people suffering from what he was suffering from and that inspired him so much that he decided to run across Canada to raise money for cancer research. For 143 days in a row, Terry ran one marathon every single day until one day the cancer spread to his lungs and he was forced to stop. He died at age 22. And if he can run that on one leg, any of us can get outside and go for a run too. Anything is possible if you just push through the pain and have the right mindset. Are you guys, uh, yeah. you guys ready to run? Or? Let's fucking do Let's it, do boys! It. Yeah. Let's go, boys! And the marathon is about to begin, kilometer zero. It's a mindset. We're on kilometer number one. We're running 21 kilometers, a half marathon on his 21st birthday. This is my first time ever running five kilometers. We're ready, we're ready. Oh, boys. I'm just really excited, you know, to run for all of this and hopefully make an impact and inspire others to do the same. Pandemic, what do you think? Terry Fox run during the pandemic? It's not gonna stop us. And we're just out here to prove to people that they are better than they think. We're out to run here for other people who can't run, can't That's be it. Great job, guys. Thanks a lot. Thanks, Thanks man. Thanks so much. Hey, guys, we hope you have a great day. We just want to say we love you. We love you. Hey, man. We're having a great day. We love you. I love you. Bird, we love you. <laughs> Keep it up, man. 1.3 left. I'm not quitting. You have any advice for anyone who wants to do this too? Uh, believe in yourself. My chest's starting to burn, but we're almost there. We can do it. Mad cramps happening. Now that you're doing it right now, that only means you can go bigger. Exactly. It means you can do it. Right? right? Well, half marathon next year. I love that. I'll get there. About kilometer eight now. Eight and a half. I thought I could only do five. Let's just keep going. 15, 17 more to go. And oh, we're gonna finish this. Why? Because it's a mindset. That's it. And that's all. Go boys, we down just, 10K. We just did 10K. Feeling good, feeling, feeling good. good. Feeling Push good. It. So we finished our 10K. Nice. It was challenging, we pushed our limits. Just finished 21K. I'm dead. It feels amazing. I think lesson of today is to get out of your comfort zone uh, and make sure you're having fun with it as well. You know, I proved myself that I could do more than I actually thought I would be able to do. We just ran a fucking marathon. I just ran a marathon. You can do anything you fucking want in your life. Just step outside your comfort zone and push yourself. It's all a mindset. Stretch it out. I can't move.